Novelli Marte. That's this guy I've got pictured here. He decided to enhancing drugs. And he has since been suspended. For, this is his first in, infraction. So uh, he's going to miss the first 80 games of the 2024. He tested positive. Bone, I guess is how you pronounce it. It's a performance enhancing drug. If you care to know, the suspension was without pay. If you didn't already know that. And uh, this guy too is an infielder, specifically and primarily plays third base for the um, and he's come up through their organization relatively quickly. Like I said, he's 22. He showed us his debut 35 games last year with Cincinnati, and he hit three homers and was admirable, serviceable in field during those 35 games. So obviously they've got such young, strong talent, especially in their infield over in Cincinnati that this is just terrible I don't know I'll get to that in a minute but obviously the Cincinnati Reds have come out and said we don't condone this we're, not, we're totally back to play with the suspension this is totally wrong etc they played they told the party to play the hometown song so um Unfortunately, coming into the 2024 season, he has been ranked as high as 35th overall in MLB's top 100 prospects lists. Uh, just depending on where you where you get that your prospect list, so, but I don't even think that's how high he is on MLB. It doesn't matter. He's he's up there. So remember um, Heimer Candelario and Candelario from Detroit and then Chicago and then with Washington last season, which for me is kind of where I was like, oh, this Condelario, yeah, third base. Okay, well, he's, because of this PED suspension, Condelario is going to end being the Reds' third baseman uh, to start opening on opening day. Uh, I'll know he's serviceable at the plate. He has some interesting defensive outings, but he's he's absolutely serviceable as a bat. He's older. I think he's 31, something I can't remember. But he's going to do a fine job, and it's going to anchor with his presence some of this year. I don't think he's going to be certainly as electric as this 22-year-old outstanding third baseman just got popped for PEDs. So the takeaway here, ladies and gentle people, is don't be stupid. Don't. The end. Stay in school. Don't do drugs, etc. cetera. 